Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm doing a reading for single Tauruses, and keep in mind that this does not resonate for all of you. If you like a personal reading, I'll leave in the description down below. You can also follow me on Instagram. So, on the bottom of the deck for the over energy for your current situation, it's going to be the Four of Pentacles. Okay. Virgo, or not Virgo. I'm sorry. I had my friend that texted me that's a Virgo, so I have that in my mind now. Anyways, Taurus. I see you receiving attention here. I see people reaching out to you. But it's very interesting. I don't see you giving that back to them. <laughs> so let's see. You have the Hierophant, Taurus energy. This is your own energy. We have the Wheel of Fortune reverse. We have the Tower. We have the two of swords reverse, and then we have the moon reverse. This can be seen as cancer or Pisces energy. Okay. So yeah, I kind of feel like you are going to have people come in your life, but I also see you kind of push them away. So I don't really see a whole lot of movement going on in your love life because you do kind of push people away. That is the main thing I get. I feel like in the past also here, I don't think you had a good relationships in the past. It's like you thought things were fine, but they actually weren't. Like there was always, there's something that was happening and then it was revealed and then, you know, whatever, past is past. So having a look at what's coming towards you, it's going to be the Death card. This is Scorpio energy. The Death card can represent, though, is transformation, letting go, releasing something. You have the Five of Wands, Two of Cups. We have the Tower, once again. We have the Queen of Cups. This is water energy. And then we have the Hierophant, this is Taurus energy, once again. You're going to have someone come into your life unexpectedly, or you're going to have someone offer you emotions unexpectedly. I don't know if you're just not expecting it, or if it's like from someone that you don't expect. But it feels like someone wants to be in a relationship with you, and it's very unexpected. So let's see, you have number 32 with Despair, you have number 36 with Distant Horizons, you have Winter, you have Sacred Space, Forgive, Compromise, Give a Relationship a Chance, you have Unrequited Love, and then you have Passion. Okay, so we are in the season of winter, so that does make a lot of sense. But with these two cards, it could be someone that's currently distant from you. And maybe they're not, you know, happy as of right now. Maybe they've dealt with unrequited love here before. I don't get them being happy, and it also feels like they're distant from you, or maybe you, they're not in your life yet. Um... Look at this. You have forgive. Then you have the death card. That is like releasing something of the past so that you can move forward here. The thing, the main thing I get for you, Taurus, is I feel like you're going to have people come into your life wanting to give you attention, wanting to be open to you, but I don't see you... I feel like it's unrequited from your end. Like, I don't feel like you love this person back, or you don't love these people back. Which is very interesting. Okay, so, Taurus, that is all I have for you. Let me know if that resonates. Thank you for watching. If you want to see more content, don't forget to like, subscribe. Bye, guys.